Yo, what is good? What is Bracken? It is your boy, the DJC, aka D Donald Carlos, and we're here for some more Pokemon Rejuvenation LP. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Rub my hands together like Birdman. We're here for episode 148 uh, of our LP. We did an episode yesterday that took that one episode. My it might seem like it was half an hour, but I was I was sitting there for about two hours for that just that one episode so i had to take i had to take a break i had to take a break uh but we're here we're back we're vibing uh i'm not sure how many episodes there are going to be this week it's pro most likely going to be two uh, um monday's episode and probably this will go up on friday but with that being said i'm going to just jump right into it uh team recap considering that our team is very different from the last time we got a, a Night Tails. Uh, we got Yung Dunk. We can't we can't go back and switch our team up. Yung Dunk, uh, Kampachi, Kami, Mysterio obviously, and Juniper the Clef is here as well, ready for action. -a. Now the real question is, where the hell do we go? Smile. Ah, uh, where do we go? What the f oh. I think the barrier from Hazuki's, you know, if you didn't see the last episode, her uh, her impenetrable barrier is still there, just invisible. Yeah. Okay. Malia's here. Malia, Venom, and Ren. Okay. Huh? What? Weren't we just in the Goldenwood Forest? Oh, man, that's a long way down. B, Alita. What, B? Aaron Cannon. Cannon, don't be alarmed, but uh, I don't think we're in Terra Gemma anymore. Terra Juma. It was good, gang. Uh, it seems as though Alexandria and Damien weren't dragged with us. Wherever this is. Uh, Alita B, where are we? I'll give you the rundown. And yeah, that's it. I had explained that a couple times today already. So, I think I got the got it pretty well. This Puppet Master is helping on destroying everything. All, all so he can create a world he sees is perfect. Why are the self-righteous ones always the people who fall in the way too much... Uh, fall into way too much power. <laughs> but why are we here? Surely this cannot be a coincidence. Bro, if they ask me to battle uh, with somebody... Oh, I gotta battle with Malia. Honestly, her team is fucking juiced out of this world. Or can it? Can it has a man's? Uh, there's no way. If anything, the puppet master is the one who brought us here. Hmm. So, if we want to return things to normal, we've got to take down the puppet master. If we work together, I think we can pull it off. Interlopers, beware! Those who are not fit for my new world shall be erased. If you wish to oppose me, then proceed up the stairs before you and face me. The battle to decide the fate of this land is imminent. So this is most likely the, the final battle of the chapter. Oh, how nice. We've got invited directly to the pub master himself. Think he has the, the tea and cookies waiting? Make, <laughs> make it cookies and ice cream and you got a deal. We got a, we got a problem though. Sandra is with us and out cold. If she wakes up, she might try and get away. Hmm. Why am I not surprised she's Team Zen Scum? In that case, leave it to us. Yeah! Zeta! What's this guy doing here? D did you just say Zeta? It's my man's! Malia, I've been meaning to talk to you. Uh, Zeta, this is the worst time to do that. They don't have much time. Right. Prepare and get yourselves out there. We're counting on all of you. Right. We'll do our best. Yeah, I've been meaning to talk to you. Uh, he's like, what? Nanny TF? Is he still blocking this? He is. Balls. And up. Balls. Alright, let's talk to the gang right quick. Puppet Master's gone too damn far. This is our world. If he, want, if he wants to destroy it, then he's gonna have to go through us. What's been going on since we've been gone? A total world of chaos and destruction? I don't want to think about it. Right? After everything we've been through down in those caves, now we have to deal with this? Looks like we've always got something messed up 
uh, messing up our day, huh, B? You better get ready. I'll put everything I've got into this. <laughs> you guys better think Sec, he's holding back the Puppet Master this entire time. If it weren't for him, the Puppet Master's nightmare would have expanded much further by now. Hope he's all right. Oh boy, freaking Sec. What the hell? What the actual hell? If the Puppet Master is capable of doing something of this magnitude, then he must hold unthinkable amounts of power. I have to think of a game plan and fast. I shall help out as well. Yes, Cannon, it would be very much appreciated. Your insight will be crucial to our success. Aaron and I learned a lot on our journey to find the diamond component. We'll tell you about it once we've settled down. All right, we see the game. Puppet Master invited us. This is it, B. The final battle against the Puppet Master is here. I'm scared, but with you and everyone else on my side, I feel like I can get through anything. Let's save our world. Let's do this. There is no, nothing to prepare. You can't go back. This is something truly extraordinary. The events that have transpired here, there are, there's, uh, there are nothing our data could have predicted. You sense it too, don't you? The force emanating up those stairs. The power that transcends even Team Zen and Madame X herself. I'm intimidated. It's true. Should we step in? At the current moment, if we were to step in, our chance of success would be approximately 74%, 7.4.8%. The 25.9% chance of failure is far too high for the gambit to be worth with us. B has an advantage of numbers. Their success rate is 86.88%. <laughs> gotcha. For now, let's spectate. Oh, that's Aaron on the freaking Absol. I was like, who the heck is that? Antelopers of the Outer World! So you have come to disturb peace after all. Very well. Ah, yes. Now he summons Grodon, Kyogre, and Rayquaza. Because what? Oh, oh, man. Yep. Interceptor! In my world, the only one who may alter the fate is me. Unauthorized usage of the core's power will be met with death. Come, the battlefield has been set. That's the Puppet Master. We have to fight that thing? Do you have the power to oppose such a being? He's huge! There's no way we could even put a dent all the way down here. I learned a new trick during my mission. If we can't... Oh, yeah. I, you, bro, that was so far, man. That was 30 episodes ago when we did that, man. Hey, that's crazy. Uh, if we can't, if we can't possibly hope to deal damage down here, then let's even the playing field. <laughs> Wah! Wah! Going up. Mm. Freaking awesome! Is this good enough? It's more than enough. It's perfect. Leah, you've used this power a lot today. Are you okay? <laughs> Don't underestimate me. As long as I can maintain my focus, this is easy. Everyone go. Uh, why are we playing the Sword of Shield music? Alright, we got a job to do. I can see the tiny puppet master's heading this way. Of course, getting to him won't be easy. Right. This is what we train for. Ken and I will provide tactical support from the floating rocks, but for now, we should just make our way to. Uh, make our way to. Blah, 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 blah. All right. They're the only ones that will battle and take down the puppet master. Is that understood? Alright, let's go. Do 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 do. Ah man, you know it's funny. Oh Delphi. Oh, it's not even Delphi. Huey, Huey, Lavender, Red. Check it. The reserve squad is at your disposal. Will terminate all evil, Star. All evil that left behind when B and the others destroy them. We chase with grace and with ulterior motives because we're usually just bored and have nothing to do. Thanks, guys. Is that Reyna? What are you doing here? Hi, Ren. I wanted to get in on this world ending event, so I found my way in, of course. You eat lavender, and I have it down here. You go on ahead. Got it. Hey, B, I'm here at your service. We'll beat the Puppet Master. Yeah! There's a Cor- Wait, Ren has a Corviknight now? I mean, it makes sense for his character. Mm -hmm. 
All right, Puffer Master, give it all you got. Come on, I said, give me your best shot. It, did he just hug him? I think how the music goes back. I think the uh, the pub master definitely is uh, trying to hug him. And yo, oh, it's uh, it's Arrow. B, is this seriously what you're doing? After all this, you're still going to fight something this massive? I gotta say, I respect the hustle. I respect the hustle. You're following my pro philosophy. You gotta keep swinging, right? That's all you can do. Listen, because we're cowards, I costed you 50% of your power. I'm here to, I'm here back to make amends to give you that half back. Let's keep swinging. Yes, exactly. We gotta keep swinging no matter what. I'm Arrow. I'm our, I am our strength. We are B. Together, we are one. Inter oh, man. The power of the interceptor increased. Now B has gained the ability to use intercept Z. Man, I don't, I don't like the, uh, the implications of intercept Z. Convert Z power into crystals that allow the chance to intercept fate. I, man, everybody can use it. Well, we have to use it on, uh, we have to use it on our starter. Uh, yeah. All right, cool. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, okay. Oh, that was weird. All right, cool. Let's get it bracking. Yush, 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 yush. All right, we're back in it. So, you finally come. Just as you asked. Good. Then let's begin. It looks super cool. They did. Jan is doing a great job with this game. And what's the point of giving us all these hints, that info? I thought you hoped in B and I to succeed. Without the data, there is no hope of survival. By making this world my own, I am saving it from an unspeakable terror. In my world, the weak will not be trampled. And the strong will not overrule. Those helpless will find new hope. And with my power bestowed by the uh, Lex Lexomnia engine, Lexomnia engine, I will bend reality in my will. But you're just forcing that on people. Even if your intentions are to help, the ends do not justify the means. B and I, everyone, we've trained so hard so that we can make a difference. With the power you display, you can make a difference in a better way. In my reality, my way is the better way. Even with your strength, you are powerless to change the future. While I was trapped inside that wretched device, I learned of horrors that cannot be defeated. Trapped? No one can stop it. Madam X cannot be defeated. Madam X? can't be defeated at its current state this world has little time left and if i do not do this everything will crumble b i don't know what oh he's talking oh oh yeah i forgot team zen still has that demon that they can unleash that they're building up to unleash we have no choice but to fight this is where the culmination of our training will kick in those who stand in my way of humanity's future shall be devoured Alright, we got a raid boss in, in, uh, in Pokemon. Let's go. Oh, and we got an Intimidate drop? Sick! Now, oh, wait, we can't even confuse raid. We have to Heat Wave here. That was a crit. Alright, say less. Oh, you know, I forgot that he could just straight up use, aw, oh, dog, aw, oh, yeah, that's not very, man, that's kind of toxic, that's kind of super duper toxic, dude, alright, alright, here's what we do, we weather ball, yep, Considering that the that the terrain is swapped, can still use Dream Eater. Balls and up uh, balls. Mm. Mm. Alright, alright. Let's do this. 
We still we still can't status him because he still has his shields up. Oh, wait, is he a dark dark fairy type? Ah, nightmare. Oh, I don't. Man, I didn't take any damage from that, huh? Yo, Magic Guard is OP! Mm. On the Gramble? Alright. You know what sucks? Is that, uh. Alita has a bunch of fighting types. So. Yeah. They're gonna get, like, molly thwomped by this. Savage spin out. But why? He still has he still has his shields up. Why would you do that? Oh wait, I forgot that you can only have one Z move at a time. And well, now that Venusaur is KO'd. Mm, oh, Mian she has a Mian Shao? Jeez. Life screen that's that's actually really good. Just, just keep on trucking with the Moonblast. Bunruka Beatdown. Alright, I... <laughs> Alright. Very star... I forgot about the star me. Oh, thank God. Finally, shoots. Barely took any damage. Man, man, they they weren't joking. He has leftovers, bro. There's no way, dude. There's no freaky way. All right, I got to uh, I had a cosmic power. I did not mean to cosmic power. I meant to thunder thunder wave him. That was a crit. Defense rose, special defense rose. you know I think the answer is uh it's gonna be clef because man does that do a lot of damage all right we got a full we got a max heal here because we, we don't have access to full heals because they're too OP for this late stage of the game apparently still so. Yeah, but the music is still jamming. Mm. Dream Eater. Astro Energy boosted the attack. Oh, I actually was resisted. Oh, is it? It's it. It's because it's Dream Eater psychic, and you know Starmie is also psychic. Star Raptor. All right. Uh, Gramble, Halucha. Mianxiao, Star Raptor, Starmie. She still has one more Mon left, and then it's at that point it's gonna be a one v one. I want to T wave him. Nice, perfect. Dude, that was a crit, bro. That was a crit. Look how much health he gained back from that. Man, look, bro, look how much health he just got back from that. The Cherum. Oh, I forgot that she had this trash Cherum. That man. Looter energy surge through the attack. Jesus Christ, I actually did a hefty chunk. Oh, and oh. Mm. All right, I take the, the little bit of nightmare damage. Ow. Giga, giga, giga drain. Like, man, Alita doesn't do any damage, like, at all. At all, at all. 
Jeez. And then bo and then all of his moves hit twice. Bro, that's crazy. I have to heal up here. Now it's a 1v1 too. Up oh, or or I could just fall over. Man. Is it that time? Dash illusion shield strike. I guess strike is what I, is what I want. That ain't do, ain't do nothing. Mm, that really didn't do a gosh darn thing. Hey, knocked off the leftovers too. He has spirit break. That definitely does hurt, though. <laughs> so, sorry for making fun of you, Mr. Puppet Master, but, uh, yep. Alright, cool. So, here's what we do. He's not healing anymore from the... And he can't... <laughs> Yo, this doesn't do any damage to me, bro. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> Serious, just like, you know, that's cool. Alright. Say less. Uh, I just flare blitz him here. Honestly, yup. That man that didn't do anything. Man that did not do a gosh darn thing. Mm. I should, I think I died a nightmare here. Mm-hmm. Mm. SD? Wait, oh, how am I? You know what? Not gonna ask. Not very effective, but it one shots me. Okay. Very interesting. Very, very interesting, by the way. Oi. Huh? He just has so much freaking health. Mm, this is a dream eater. God, this is the one time I wish I had Weave All. Ow. Hey, man. How's it going? I think at this point I just have to keep spamming knockoff, right? Yes, no, maybe so. Oi. Like, I don't do any damage to this thing. Mm -hmm. I can use one more. I have to bring back Clef then. This Clef gets double boosted. Mm hmm. Oi. Alright, cool. Very epic. Gamer noises. I like how he hasn't been, uh... He hasn't been paralyzed once. As well. I don't know if you noticed that, but I definitely did. Not a single time has this man been paralyzed. Jesus Christ, that does a lot of damage. Alright, cool. I, I know the strat now. I 100% I know the strat. We, he's, he's dying today. Alright. So, where did I save last? Okay, it put me right there. Perfect. So, we have to lead. I think we have to lead uh, Mysterio first. Because I think he, while he has the shield, you can, you can knock off the, uh, I know you can hear that, by the way, because uh, I can hear that through the headset. I, my father has headphones. Don't worry about it. 
Anyway, intercept Z. I'm not gonna mess with the interceptor stuff because it really didn't do anything. All right, so. We can't seed them. Can we seed them? I don't think so. All right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. Come on. Come on. All right. So we have to knock off immediately. Super effective. Perfect. Mm -hmm. So I think the way we do this, I don't like how Nightmare gets double boosted because I'm assuming he has like parental bond or something. Don't miss. Okay, good. All right, and since both the attacks are are, uh, are super effective, it chunks through the shield or not. It just, I was just capping. Hey, yo, my bad. I got caught lacking. That that's never good. That's actually never good. That the um. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, he brings out the star me right away. Let's go. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Nice. I actually wish I had mirror something with mirror armor, so that I can um I can spotlight the attacks. Like on Ensign, because that'd be perfect. That's resisted, by the way. That is resisted damage. And he's, he's going to die to the Nightmare. Okay. He didn't He didn't just die to the, uh, to the Nightmare outright. Thank God. It's freaking resisted damage. My ass, bro. What? Now that was toxic. Spirit break. Doesn't matter, he's dead anyway. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, here's what I do. I bring out Kimpachi here to break the shield. Because for whatever reason, I am still faster than this. I think all mons are just faster than this thing. Why? Why would you do that? I just very... Whatever, man. Mm. Resisted, by the way, and it's still... That has to be a special move. That 100% has to be special. Alright, we exit here. All right, so he's a psychic type. Jesus Christ, that did so much damage! Holy smokes, that did a lot. All right, this might be the tech. No, this might one hundred percent doesn't help that me. I just got one tap, but ah, uh, if I got a chance to freaking. Like, I just can't predict what he's going to do. But, man, does that do a lot of damage. There's a nightmare. That would have been the perfect time to SD. But, again, there's no way to predict what he's going to do. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> See, this is why hindsight is, like, 20. Well... Yeah, no, hindsight's 20, 20. There's like no way I would have known the first time that Kimpachi would have did this much, this amount of damage my first time fighting it. Mm. Dude, huh? The world is taking shape, new shape. What, what, huh? I don't like this. Trim music, you can drain. I'm still alive. I am still allowed to exist. Oh, bro. 
Bro, I freaking love Excalibur. Excalibur hits so freaking hard all the time, dude. Oh, this is exactly why they, they didn't want to put Excalibur in Sword and Shield. This is 100% the reason why. Because they know this, this mod is absolutely cracked out of its mind. Is that enough? Did we do it? Ugh. You are strong, but not strong enough. What? Nanny? What? Huh? huh? But how? That attack hit us directly. Am I only a little scratched? How is it possible? My attack. Hey, what's wrong? You talked a lot about garbage back there. You realized it, didn't you? Your power means nothing in this world. No way. Is, is that the other B or rather arrow? How are you speaking to me, arrow? You have awoken, but you still... <laughs> Well, you should have stayed deep within B's soul. Why was the S capitalized? For uh, living here, you don't know too much about it. The Lexomnia engine projects the dreams of those within it. That includes everyone, not just you. It cannot be. Sorry, but you got that wrong. B's actions haven't gone unnoticed, especially after Ecclesia. Everyone is rooting for B's victory. And if everyone is dreaming about B's success, their dream will become reality. Lead is right. We've only made it this far because B has been there to pull us through times of trouble. Ever since Black Steeple, B has been my foundation of hope. I know they'll pull through no matter what. I'll believe in B until the very end. I really wish we still had the lost episodes, but those still. The freaking lost episode where we got sent to a different timeline would just don't exist on this channel. It. It's it's whatever. B has done so much for all of us. B helped me escape Isha's clutches. I will always be grateful for that. I believe in B until the very end. B was super cool against Gardevoir in the past, you know. They saved my brother's life. I believe in B until I make fucking die. <laughs> all right. When I first met B, I know we were going to be rivals, but at this point, I know B has surpassed me in terms of strength and as a person. I couldn't be happier. B bud, I believe in you. Always. B whooped my ass back in these gear. <laughs> Do you know how humiliating that was? It sucked. But I love B's energy so much that I just had a vibe with it. Fuck off, Puppet Master. I believe in B. I You know? At first, I thought B was extremely weird. Ironic coming from me, you know. But if there was one thing that had changed my mind, it'd be their determination to keep going no matter how difficult the circumstances. And for those aforementioned reasons, I believe in B. Leia Alexandria holds B to a high, a very high standard. So, of course, naturally, B would have a good impression on me as well. If Alexandria believes, no. It's not that about what Alexandria thinks. It's about how I feel, how I think. And even then, I don't know. <laughs> what I think and now that I believe in B B and I have been on this journey together for a long time it's been incredible without B I never would have learned the truth about Kenneth about my past I never would have made it right here before you Puppet Master B I believe in you, you hear that that's B's friends carrying us with this much support victory is assured let's team up and end this B I believe in you We'll dream a dream so big it becomes a miracle. Oh man. Bro, what? I got a 1v1 of them now. The Interceptor's form has changed. Has fate changed as well? Now, what if I get my cheeks clapped, dog? Yung Dunk. I'm a knockoff here. Uh, I'm a knockoff and bring out Juniper out here. Evan. Hey. Hold up. Wait. Oh, 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 oh. Skirt, skirt. Boop, beep, doop, beep. Oh, he doesn't have. Oh, okay. Oh, man. This is going to be real awkward for you, Mr. Puppet Master. Hey. 
Ey. Brr, brr, pow. Ey, ey. Oh, oh, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, oh. Bro, bro, he just got... <laughs> bro. You just got fucking domed, dude. What the fuck, bro? There's no way. There's no fucking way, dude. The people's belief in you exceeds this dimension's belief in me. That's why, in the end, you were able to best me. Interceptor. Oh, Interceptor, is this your true power? Perhaps if you believe, perhaps if you believed in me and all of us, then maybe things would have ended different. B, allow me to ask you a favor, please. Destroy me. Huh? This world has no need for me. With you in it, the ability to change fate is great, and I am a fool. Even without Clear and Karen's data, I've yearned so deeply. I believe that you are the opportunity itself, Puppet Master. Oh, I forgot there was a ghost. Huey? Bro, you good, dog? He has a Keckley on. Yo, you you good, dog? Oh my god! Ah, <laughs> uh, it's pro. It's protean freaking Keckley on. Soccer punch. I say less. Resisted. Ah, mm, mm, uh, hmm. Glocktillery? Alright. Swap. John. Okay. Huh? What? Huh? Hey. Hey. Hey, 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 hold up, wait, oh, uh, oh, uh, okay, okay. It's a Flareon, all right, say less. He's still taking the superpower dig. <laughs> all right, cool, perfect. He's gonna Flare Blitz me here. Mm, is he going to flare blitz or fa facade? Oh, he's going to facade. That's a yikes. I am still alive. I am faster than this Flareon too, huh? Yo, that's crazy. I am the man in my city. Hey, I'm going hand me your bitty. Hey, I just knock off here. He has, of course he has quick attack. Of course he has this fucking move. Did it have a fire tank move? Quick attack. No, he has to. What am I saying? I'm smoking pack. Yeah, what's up, buddy? Earth power. That didn't do any damage. Well, he's intimidated. Glalie? I mean... Fuck it. Kenpunchi! Glottillery, yo, that's crazy, man. Yo, that's crazy. I am the man of my city. I, uh, whoa! Go, 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 go! I'm just saying, even if I wasn't uh, the Interceptor, my man Huey is getting his boots smoked right now. Like, oh, bounce? I, 
I'm surprised he's faster than me. Something like faded? Yeah, something like faded. I should not do that. I got paralyzed though. Still landed the heat wave though. Burn? No burn. All right, that's cool though. My man is getting his boots smoked right now. Perfect, perfect. Cool, excellent. I, uh, yup. Palisan. <laughs> you looking like a paladero, looking like a palisade. Hey, I'm just coming through to just one tap him right quick. You feel me? Uh, I just heat wave. I am so fast in this palisan. Man. That's fine. I don't care. I just really have two fire types on my team. <laughs> I mean, a water type doesn't matter. I have a young donk. Max speed chlorophyll. Can fast as shit. Please. Huey? B, I'm sorry. I didn't fight you with the intention of beating you, but I just couldn't let you do it. Puppet Master. You gave me the power to imagine what I wanted in this realm. Is that right? Uh, always so coy. You remind me of someone. Fine. Then I want to imagine something one last time. I want to imagine that you're not hurt. I want to imagine you smiling again. I want I want you to, want you to be you again. Rune. Oh. Well, this took a turn of events. How? Huey. Road! I thought I would never see you again. I thought you were dead. The way that Puppet Master said it'll be okay, I knew. I just, I just knew. I'm so sorry for causing you so much pain. And here I am now. I know you're not here. I know you're here now. Sniffle. B. And Alita, I'm so sorry for everything. I'm sorry. I'm just really in shock right now. The entire time, Rune was the puppet master. Yes, it's true. I was the one that was guiding everyone. The one who put you through the school of nightmares. The one who appeared in Hazuki's dream and told her all those horrible truths. In an attempt to save people, I hurt them too. And I'm so sorry. What happened to you? Huey, you must understand something. Though you and I are here together, Rune is gone. What, what do you mean? Just like Risa, Sek, and Zeta, I am just Data. The Rune you long for is no longer. I am gone. I'm just going to assume that I am gone. Now, I'm going to explain things from the beginning. My name is Rune, and originally I was from the uh, Myria region. At the age of 16, I was recognized as a prodigy detective and I was put on a case to find out what the original Team Zen was up to. The mission was top secret, and I could, couldn't let anyone know my identity. So I went under the alias Freya. I clashed with Team Zen, but ultimately failed, causing the nuclear plants to explode. Ten individuals died at that site, or rather, that's what was written. Two people survived that explosion. The undercover sleuth Freya, and the six-year-old boy named Huey. Uh, for reasons unbeknownst to me, Huey and I were sent to the voidal chasm we spent over half a decade there until someone found us uh that girl was flora she had recently fallen into the void herself and we worked together to escape i took flora and i a few days to get little huey out but we did it and as a result we formed an incredible bond of friendship because we spent so much time trapped within the chasm the person huey and i all oh, Huey and I were before we were wiped clean. In fact, deep down, I didn't even know who Huey really was. All I knew was that he was important and I needed to protect him. So, you just need, uh, like a fake identity and all that stuff, right? If giving Huey something, uh, someone of a normal knife is what you want, I can do that. How? How could you be capable of doing such things? Don't worry, I've got people for that. 
Florida managed to create a whole fake scenario for Huey and I, coupled with fake parents, fake photos, fake uh, accident record. At the time, I had no idea she meant uh, how she managed to create a fictional family, but she did it. We enrolled in Access High University, and we were best friends. When we graduated, Mr. Blakery liked me so much that he offered me a teaching position. In exchange for free admission for Huey, I accepted, of course. But this is where the story truly began. <clears throat> you two seem to be very happy. How about, how's your project coming along? Zara and, um, and Jean. Uh, all as well as we need it to. The Luxomnia engine is going to shatter the results at that competition. Don't you think the Luxomnia engine is kind of a mouthful? Uh, I still think Dream Machine gets the point just fine. Sure it does, but it doesn't give it that pizzazz. It needs to be impressive. If it works, it'll be a hard project to defeat at the top-notch competition. See, Gene? It's in the bag. We just need to work reliably now. Whatever you say, bro. I'll be back. Even hinting that I was considering voting for their project was a mistake, I admit that much. However, I had every intention of doing so. Mr. Blakery, on the other hand, had other ideas in mind. Oh, Mr. Blakery, what can I do for you? It's come to my attention that the jury for the top-notch competition is uneven this time around. Oh, is it? I. Uh, it has also come to my attention that the jury also seems to be split on deciding the winner. Can you believe that? The competition hasn't even started. Uh, where are you going with this, sir? Currently, Sockatron and the Luxomnia engine are tied. However, if you were to vote Sockatron, that would break the tie. Sir, you can't be serious. I'm not going to rig the results just so that... That's a shame. I thought after everything I've done for you. Well, in that case, I suppose Huey's education doesn't matter to you. Man. Man, this guy's a dick. Well, we knew he was a dick before, but he's, he's like a... He's like a big old flaccid micro penis. Anyway, I did what he said, and Saki won the competition. But as a result, I at least hell on our grounds. One day, Risa stopped showing up to class. Then another student stopped showing up, and then another and another. But then all but Risa showed up. But this time, in the form of Stone. Mr. Blakery, students are disappearing left and right. We can't just sit by and do nothing. It's a tragedy, a tragedy I condemn, but a tragedy nonetheless. What more can we do but make the students feel safe at school? Mr. Blakery, how can you be so irresponsible? Young woman, I offered you a position here because you were exemplary. But if you keep this up, I'm going to have to suspend you for a while. Listen, this is no job for a teacher such as yourself. Just be calm and leave this to the detectives. Leave it to the detectives, huh? Fine, then. I'll leave it to the detectives. As you should. Good day, Rue. Well, does, she, does he know that she used to be a detective in a past life? I've had enough of being told to sit around and do nothing. If Mr. Blakery wanted me, wanted me to leave it to the detectives, then I will fulfill his wish. Uh, I dove all my time into investigating this cause and chased the culprit who dared endanger the students of the GDC. As long as I was alive, I would not stop, no matter what. Mm, that's what I genuinely believe that was until I received this letter in a red envelope. Dear Rune, if you do not stop the investigation of the missing students, we will unleash a never-ending nightmare on you. If you value yours and Huey's life, cease. I want to know from the culprit. The culprit knew who I was. They knew that I was investigating the case. I wouldn't take the chance, so I gather up the funds and went far away from the GDC. Tally result is isolated away from most of the region and wouldn't have the cold and harsh climate of the Atresia region su suffered. I didn't know how long we'd stay, but we could uh, have, uh, but we had to leave the first chance we could. After a long day, I decided to visit a nearby cave to cool down. That's when I heard a scream, uh, scream and lo and behold, it was none other than Sockley Bakery. She had been attacked by legendary Pokemon Kyogre. Fortunately, wait, when did Saki get attacked by Kyogre? Fortunately, I was able to subdue its anger and send it running. Hey, that was super cool. You must be really strong if you're taking out legendary Pokemon that easy. And has anyone ever told you that you have beautiful red hair? Actually reminds me of someone I knew back at school. 
Who was it? Hmm. I don't know. Uh, it really doesn't matter anyway. What's your name? Name's Freya. Freya, that's a cool name. It means fire, right? Fire, you just like my friend Zara and Jean back at Axis High. Zara has been so mad ever since she and Risa stopped talking to each other uh, for a while. What did you say? Yeah, my friend Zara and Risa got into a big fight the other day. The two stormed out of the classroom and they looked like steamed hams. And now they're <clears throat> taking their anger out on me. It's like Zara and Jean hate me for some reason, but I don't know why. I have to go. Be safe, Saki. Sure, but hey, how do you know my name? Wait. Saki's words were exactly what I needed to put the puzzle together. I got the Huey and left. we left the resort. When we returned, I looked into Zara and Jean for some more. Their sudden disdain for Miss Blakery lined up when I realized that Saki had beat them in that competition way back. Turns out they, too, were skeptical of the results and felt cheated. Uh, I looked further into detail about the students. I'm in turn to stone. Each of the students had one thing in common. They shared Saki's GPA. They had been, uh, that had been their MO the entire time. At this point, I knew it was them. Got up and decided to investigate myself until... You going out again? Huey. You're always going out so late at night, room. What, what are you doing? Huey, I promise I'm going to explain everything to you when... It was my birthday yesterday. You didn't even come home yesterday. Huey, I'm, I'm so sorry. You don't even talk to me anymore, Rune. Do you hate me? Huey, how could you say that? You and I haven't spoken more than uh, one thing in more than a month. Spoken more than one thing in more than a month. Even when we went on vacation to Terra Gemma, you barely said anything. All you did was wander off and leave me alone by myself. Why? Mm. Sorry, Huey, I have to go now. Rune, I hate you. It's a strong word. I'm in a dream yard. Risa! So yeah, at that point, that those weren't the real Zara in uh, in Jean. That was um, Silver Surfer in, in Clear. You pushed us to this. We gave you a warning you didn't listen. Mrs. Rune, we respect you uh, a lot as my teacher, but you've crossed the line. Crossed the line? Me? Look at you. What do you do? Tacky students turned them into stone? Then poor Risa? Oh, God, Risa. Everything we've done up to this point uh, has been for Risa. And your life will be sacrificed to her as well. A sacrifice? What are you going to do with me? The Luxomni Engine project must succeed. I need... I need to see Risa once more. Sorry, teacher. Sorry, Gene. Stop, please, Huey. Where am I? I put wait list. She's dead. Huh? Is that Zyra? The upload fail. We'll just carry on and find another test subject and try again. Rune is nothing but stone now. We can't let her out. Destroy her body, dispose of it. Got it. Stop. The experiment didn't fail. I'm not dead. Zara Jean, please, can't you hear me? Can't you hear me? No, they're gone. <laughs> Kiki, key, key, key. Did I really think I, I could change anything? Why was I being so foolish? Now I'm stuck here in this digital space forever. Alone. Forever. This is my punishment for failure, isn't it? This is my hell. I deserve this. I'm so sorry, everyone. I'm so sorry, Flora. I'm sorry, Huey. Please forgive me. Huh? Nanny? What? What is this? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Clear Karen had no idea of my existence and began uploading their data into the system. Because my mind had been integrated into the engine, everything began to flow inside my mind. Oh, Valerie's there. Uh, Delphi's there. Oh, Cam is there. Malia, Vanum. Oh, Dr. Jenner. Oh, it's my man's. Ren's over here. Amber's here. Aaron, bro. Aaron's cool. Aaron's cool as shit. Anyway, uh, I learned about Malia, Vanum, Kenneth, Talia, Team Zen, Zeta, the Interceptor. All this information was at my fingertips. Underneath it all, 
All was a harrowing truth. Team Zen's plan to destroy everything was Storm Nine. The imminent threat to of the Zenpergus on Grand Dream City. I knew I had to do something no matter what. I had to become the one to change fate. My ambitions, inhibitions, and my emotional ties to the world would hold me back. So I purposely corrupted my data and created another self. The Puppet Master. The wrong people had been pulling the strings for far too long. I created a nightmare city and awaited the day B would enter Grand Dream City. Simply re relaying information to the Interceptor would not be beneficial. They had to grow and prepare themselves before they were ready to learn who they were. Not just them, I needed to awaken Malia, Aaron, Alice, and Alan. For death was the only way to awaken the fragments of the archetype within them, I appeared to Hazuki as Thomas Blakery in her dreams and gained their help in exchange for information on Mr. Blakery. He made information to Thomas Blakery and he placed them in boxes where I instructed him to do so. In the meantime, Hazuki helped me prepare the School of Nightmares, and thus began my fight against Claire and Karen. <sighs> I suspected that my alter ego may have gone out of control in the, uh, in the event of failure, so I left a back door open for me. If you were ever to realize my identity, he wished for me and I would appear. Room. Can't, uh, I can't believe that all this was you. Uh, not to bring up the past, but you kind of uh, had me and my family blown up. Didn't exactly feel nice, you know. Yeah, sorry, like I said. The archetype is the only comes forth when the person experiences death. Think of it as a backup generator of sorts. That implies that if we somehow lost the archetype, you're correct. If the archetype is drained from your soul, you will die. Cool. Noted. I wasn't able to get my hands on what Claire and Karen were hiding, but I was able to retrieve some of it. Everything you saw in the School of Nightmares and that little data I retrieved will be sent to you, all of you when this is over. It should be on Thomas Blaker's computer. Please retrieve it when you can. You will. Thank you so much. This world is continuing to grow. I must put an end to it myself. Rune, don't leave again. Oh, Huey. This is how it must be. Besides, just look at how much you've grown. You don't need me anymore. But, but I want you to be here. I don't care if I don't need it. That's just how it's gotta be, kid. Her time has passed. Zeta? You can say that for all of us, really. Yeah! Oh well, it was fun. Freaking sec, dude. Freaking sec, man. But now it's time for us to retire for good. Lavender? Yes. Thank you for always being there for Huey. <laughs> I'll continue to look after him for the rest of my life, so you don't have to worry. Hmm. And Reyna? Y yes ma'am. Thank you for being a big sister for Huey in my absence. Pfft, that, it was easy. And I'll be his big sister from now on, okay? I'll pass the baton on to you. Maroon? Huey, this is goodbye for, for good. There are so many things I wanted to show you, but we ran out of time. At, at least I got to say goodbye this time. Rune, I love you, and I'll miss you. Meanwhile, it's just me and Zeta just dapping each other up like, it was good, G. It was sub gang gang. <laughs> it's been real, guys. Well, actually, it hasn't been real. <laughs> it was just a dream. And the real, uh, but it was a real adventure either way. Maybe now I can finally rest. My brother and sister will be okay without me. The world is in your hands, everyone. We'll do well. Goodbye. Hey, yo, Zeta! Let's go! That's my man's right there. He used to be a dick. But now he's a cool dude. It's been a real honor working with you, Puppet Master. You've shown me more kindness than anyone at Team Xana HQ ever has. I'll never forget it. I was kind of a helper robot Zyra made in her spare time. But you, uh, you helped me become something I've always wanted to. An annoyance! <laughs> bon voyage, it's time to go. Good luck, B, Malia. We give our strength to you. Oh, bro, where, where's Coffee Gregus at, man? Where's my man Coffee Gregus? Aya. Uh, Rune really did it. Everything's back to normal. But where's everyone else? Huey, Lavender? They never woke up uh, the way B and I did. They're most likely just waking up now. We should go greet them. You guys go do that. We have something to take care of. 
Yeah, you know the body that's over there. Hello everyone and welcome to Gara News. I'm your host Volta and boy do we have multiple stories for you today. Thanks to the efforts of a small group of heroes, the distortion around Axis High University has settled down. But nothing could compare the re nothing could prepare the region for what was hiding beneath the rubble. Head Mr. Suzuki Blakery and three students have been pronounced dead. Oh god. One being the beloved superstar Risa Raider. She dead as shit. And the other two being Zara Bella and Jean Rollos. Fans have gathered in the District of Hope to hold a memorial service for all three students and Hazuki Blakery. The cause of death is unknown, at, unknown to us at this moment. But that's not all. Mr. Blakery has been arrested by authorities early this morning. While the certain, uh, certain charges faced against him are unknown at this time, it's being stated that he has admitted guilt to all of them. But if you think that's all, you'd better sit down for this one. Mayor Cassandra of Grand Dream City has been arrested for possible connections to the black market and illegal activities. Mr. Blakery is expected to be tried in court in a couple days. Cassandra is being held for questioning at this time. Thank you for watching Gary News. We hope to see you again soon. I gotta be careful. I don't want to accidentally close out the tab. Next day, Mr. Blakery's press release. Bro, this shit log is fucked. Uh, Mr. Blakery, is it true that you had something to do with the distortion at Axis High? Sorry, no comment. Mr. Blakery, your wife was found dead in her bed after the distortion ceased. She had no apparent injuries, but people are saying that you had something to do with her death. No comment, sorry. Mr. Ray and two other students have been miss uh, and the missing woman rune have all died on your grounds. What do you have to say about that? Yeah, <laughs> no comment, sorry. Now that Hazuki Blakery is gone, you have been arrested, what is left in store for Axis High? Access, univer Access High University will be closed for the time being. Students and teachers may still use the facilities, but classes will not be held. That is all. Since you're stepping down as CEO of Blakery Co., does that mean Saki Blakery is the new CEO? The transfer has not been completed, but it is planned for Saki to take over once things have settled. Alright, that's enough questions for today. That's the end of the press release. The Blakery's have filled the city at the turmoil. Ah, oh, three more experiments have caused distortion in this world and it resulted in casualties. Azuki Blakery was killed by Thomas Blakery Sr. Justice must be brought to the ones that have passed. Azuki Blakery, Risa Raider, Gene Rollos, Sarah Bella, Ron Hagen. Eww. Zagi? It's good. Mom, Dad, what are you guys doing here? I thought you guys were just finishing a deal in Jubilife City. Uh, we were, but, uh... <laughs> But you know, we already know what's going on. Saki, we've come because it's not safe for you to be alone. But I can take care of myself. I understand, hon. But uh, please look at it from our perspective. The Blakery name is under heavy fire at the moment. The state of the school and the Blakery company is uncertain. And there's a slew of threats coming in recently. We can't, uh, we can't take any chances. Please come with us to guarantee for right now. I understand. Okay. Wait, they got a crib in Oh, they're probably staying at the hotel in Garen. Saki did spend the night here at the Chrysolia Hotel. Bright and early in the morning, we'll take... We'll be taking the first flight to Hearthome City. Wait, we're going to Sinnoh? But what about my life here? My friends? It's only for a little while, love. Just until things die down a bit. We don't want to pull you away from your, uh, from your life, but your father and I think it's necessary. I know this is hard... Uh, it's hard. I very much do, but this would be for the best. How about we go to that poffin shop you love so much? I always did love a good poffin. Have your father, <clears throat> your father and I have phone calls to make, but if you're hungry, you can call room service. All right. So, I guess I I should get comfortable. I don't know how much of this is actually left. Oh, bro, I don't know how much of this is actually left. Uh, Jesus Christ, this freaking hotel room is big. Uh, so I guess we're just gonna keep going and figure out what we're gonna do. Uh huh. Da 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 da. Remember the second period of turn on the West Garen? Civilians are demanding for a thorough investigation of the house and the facilities of West Garen area. Oh no. If, if there's one thing we can all agree on is that things are not looking swell for the Blakery. Authorities have cleared out. 
protesters that are deemed threat we advise the trainers do not visit those areas at this period in time can't believe this is happening but it's deserved all of it i guess mom and dad figured people would be looking for me at my home so they brought me here i don't think there's a safe place anywhere for me okay just gonna cock and balls so far down i can see people down there living their normal lives I've never looked at normal life, did I? Running around, enjoying life while it was while people were suffering, made it happen. What was doing this time? What the heck am I supposed to do? Gosh dang. Uh. His bookshelf has the story of Pangoran and Zora. That was at the start of uh, the game. Eric and I's favorite book. No way. No. Reminds me of the time I dressed up as a Caterpie because, ah, oh, shit, I don't remember. But Eric dressed up as Pangoro. Ha, he tried to chase me, but he was way too short to walk in that costume. Second nerd. Mofugin pool? Pool looks like it's never been used before. So pristine, so spotless. Has anyone even been in this penthouse before? The price for this place is approximately 423875 And for what? This place ain't even that special. Oh, I know why. It's because it has the name Blakery on it. So stupid. Stupid pool. You useless pool, you know that? So dumb and stupid and large. <laughs> what have you done? Nothing but be a pool, idiot. Dumb, dumb idiot. Get pool looking motherfucker. Point me right now. All um, those people who would run me over. I don't want to deal with that. That's all my answers. I don't have any of them. Sorry, Sai. So. Hmm. Die, things aren't looking good. Uh, even the Crisolia Hotel has been hit with numerous phone calls demanding that it shut down. Don't get me started. I'll check the numbers. People are pulling out their stocks. At this rate, Blakery Co. won't be worth even a dime. Uh, Ame, can you come back for this? Uh, we have to. The company is doing well, but it's nowhere near the size of the Blakery Co. I'm prepared to throw everything into it to make this company survive. Truthfully, I don't even care about the company or anything. I just want Saki to have a good life, that's all. Yeah. Can have said it better myself. I'll work even harder for myself for her sake. That's darling, I shall too. Let's work harder. My parents. They've always worked so hard for me, and all this time I thought they didn't care. I'm so, I'm so stupid. Ring, ring, motherfucker. The phone? Who be calling? Sound like it was coming from the West. <laughs> uh, there we go. I'm like, hello, Saki. Thank goodness, Eric. How did you know I was here? I didn't. I called multiple places. You might be, and you picked up this one. Although this one was trickier because I had to bypass the front desk. But still, I'm glad to hear that you're okay. Man, you're so dedicated to the wrong things. You know that? But you're my friend. That's not a bad thing at all. True, that's true. Anyway, have you been lately? I could be better, I guess. Ben's been depressed. Parents showed up, brought me back to this hotel for safety reasons, and tomorrow I'm off to Hearthome City. Hearthome? Zeno? But why? Because it's not safe for me in the Avrium right now. So many people want to hurt us, I don't really blame them. But you didn't do anything. Yeah, that's the problem. Look, you can't go to Zeno. I did call to check up on you, but there's another reason. Eh? Lavender and Amber started searching the hidden lab beneath the school on Aaron's request. We found a lot of screwed up things. Like what? Like there's still people down there locked up in pods. We found your real body, Saki. Lavender wants to talk to you uh, about getting your real body back. But she doesn't want to talk to you over the phone. You need to be here. But I can't. I don't have any way of getting there. My parents are working hard to keep me safe and it doesn't feel right. But this, this has to do with you. The body you're using isn't yours. I mean, it is, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Hey, uh, you're at Cresselia Hotel, right? I can probably get a helicopter there. Sigh. Don't worry. I can request one at the front desk. It'll take me about a day or so to get so get there. Got it. I'll let everyone know you're coming. Hey, um, Eric? Yeah. Thanks for calling me. No problem, dude. One last thing. Could you... Alright, I think, you know what, we can end it there.
that's that's a good enough spot to end it. Uh, we will continue on in the next episode. I I guess. I think there's like one episode left, unless this this next section takes another three hours. Then there'll be more than just one episode left. But man, yo, this game's crazy. Uh, anyway, yo, no, that's it. That's the bar. I'm out of here. That that was a lot, like a lot. Deuce it is.